Hello, my name is Marcus Darden. I work in computer science, and I want to start out by saying I don't want to go on strike. None of the lecturers want to go on strike. None of us want to leave our students. We work hard and are very committed to them and the jobs that we do, and leaving for a job action is very distasteful to every one of us. But if that's what we have to do, then that's what we're going to do. We have a bit of a difference on the North Campus. This is where engineering is than some of the things on, that are going on on Central Campus. And this is largely because of the differences between engineering and the things that are going on in technology and many of our other classical subjects. In engineering, we're finding all of our good talent is generally going to work. So finding and hiring and retaining good people is crucial and is getting more and more difficult by the day as higher paying jobs are being offered six-figure salaries to graduating undergraduates in computer science is not uncommon. Getting that person to go to school to get a master's degree, to get a PhD, and then come back and be a professor is extremely difficult. We're finding that to be hard and so oftentimes we end up getting people that have already made their way through the professional world. They've worked for 20 or 30 years and then still want to give back by going back to teach. And those are the ones that we really are interested in. They've got all kinds of experience and knowledge and they really fit the bill for what we're trying to offer at the University of Michigan in, in terms of world-class education. The challenge here, though, is letting them know where these positions exist. They go look for a job. They want to see something that's a professor's job or a visiting professor's job. It's kind of got the name professor in it. And so oftentimes these people have made enough money that salary isn't as much of an issue for them, but the respect that they want to feel that I've earned after 20 or 30 years in industry, after I've built projects such as Bing search engine or given crucial uh, algorithms to Google, these are the, the people that we want at the University of Michigan. And they look at our title and say, huh, lecturer, that's interesting, right? That's not the job position I was looking for, so oftentimes they don't even find our postings because they're listed as lecturer instead of professor. So our ask really is to find a way to allow individual units to decide whether or not the lecturers can change their titles. No change to the job uh, placement, but it would give us the ability to say, this person can be recognized as a professor. One last thing I'll say, I, ta I taught in a class with another lecturer um, who I've known for many years, and him and I have taught this course for, for years on end, and we had a new professor that came to teach with us. Well, he's not a new professor. He's been here for a while as well. But he is a, a tenure-track professor with tenure, and so as we taught the course, the listing on the course was Mr. Marcus Darden, Dr. David Paoletti, and Professor Igor Markov. Many students thought that Professor was the one that was in charge because he was the one with the professorial title. However, it was the Mr. and the Doctor that ran the course on a day-in and day-out basis for years on end, and we were the ones who were really in charge. And so we're looking for the ability to have a respectful title. That's it. This is a non-monetary ask. And in addition, we want to make sure that we get to stand here in solidarity with those of us who have other challenges. Thank you.